this is a video that I dropped over two years ago. Well, actually, it was two years ago to the day. Today is May the 2nd, 2024. And this is a video I dropped two years ago with the same energy that I'm putting right now on my YouTube channel. I need you to guys to share these kind of videos. I know we talk a lot about ride share, but this is about real life. This video explains how life works. And if you want to go forward, you want to succeed, you got to surround yourself with people who want to see you win. Because just like one time, 3M Designs was on my channel. He said, when people like you, they want to see you win. There's a lot of people that don't want to see you win. They don't like you. You probably got to get them out of your circle. What's up, y'all? This is Jay Watts. Today's episode is, if you got a business, make sure people are supporting you. If you run a business, make sure the people around you support your business. Because if the people around you are not supporting your business, they're not supporting your success. And I know a lot of people want to see you successful. Like, you know, I got friends that sell baby items. I don't have a baby. I got a 14-year-old, a 20-year-old. But what I do is I promote their businesses to people that have babies. I make sure they don't go like the Babies R Us or something like that. I'm promoting the business of my friends because I want to see my friends successful. Now, if I had a baby, I would be buying baby items from my friends. But... There are things out there, services that some of our friends provide, products that some of our friends provide that we don't even look at. We'd be like, yeah, man, I want to go get some barbecue. You know a friend that sells food? You know a friend that sells barbecue? That should be the first person you call. But instead, they'd be like, hey, man, let's go over to uh, Memphis Barbecue, get some barbecue real quick. Why don't you call your friend first? Support your friend. You want to see your friend successful, but you're not marching towards your friend's success with them. I mean, success is, is hard to do because we got a lot of people out there who claim to be friends and claim to be supportive of you. But secretly, they hating on you. They sit in the background like, yeah, this my man, man, yeah. I ain't gonna be doing nothing, yeah, you know this. Cause they ain't supporting you. But then they see you put something online, they be like, oh, good shit, man, good shit. Congrats on that, congrats on that, man. I ain't gonna eat that motherfucker shit, man. Fuck that motherfucker, man. That's how they act. So, if you got people like that around you, you ain't making it nowhere. I remove people like that from around me on purpose. People be like, Jeff, man, I thought you was a real friend. I'm not your real fucking friend if you ain't supporting me. And that's just me being real with you. I've got a lot of people supporting my t-shirt business for years. A lot of M109 riders. A lot of people who are just married and just want shirts for their family. People that truly just supported me. They wanted to see me succeed. So even if they bought one shirt, I don't care if you bought one of you bought ten. The fact that you bought one shows me that you wanted to see me succeed. And I regard you as a friend, as a family member. Because a lot of people out there that won't do the same thing you doing. So the people that, that are around me or that you no longer see around me say, man, I don't see this dude around Jeff no more. I don't see this dude on Jeff page or I don't see Jeff on that dude page. So I probably don't fuck with them. And I don't got to announce my departure like I'm leaving an airport. If I don't want to deal with somebody, just stop dealing with them. I don't got to be, hey, man, I'm, I'm done dealing with you because, no. If you don't see me no more, that means I don't fuck with you no more. That's all that means. Is I'm, I'm too grown to have to tell everybody when I'm leaving, I don't need to announce my departure. I just, it's time for me to roll. It's time for me to roll. If you see new people in my life, it's because I'm introducing these new people to what I do. I'm trying to learn what they do. We're trying to see if we all fit. If we don't all fit, then we just quit. We just like, you know what? I thought you was cool. You hung out with me for a few months or hung out with you for a few months. You've been around for, you know what? We on different, we on different levels. I'm trying to go somewhere. You going in a different direction. I don't want to pull you from what you're trying to do. And I don't want you to pull me from what I'm trying to do. It's all about success. So if you got people out there pulling for you, oh, you'll make it pretty far. Because everybody knows I've had to rebuild a few times, a couple of divorces. I had to rebuild from the bottom a few times. But how do I keep rebuilding? Because I know who is around me. People around me are supporting me, not pushing me down. I don't add people to my Facebook page from, like, back when I used to be married and doing stuff like that. I would add, like, her people to my page. Them people don't know me. Them people don't care about me. Them people don't want to see me succeed. They want to see how she would be doing. That's how it always, whenever I would date a girl, all her friends would try to add me. All her male friends, female would try to add me. But then when we split, I got to get rid of all them people because them people was never around for my success in the first place. That's why I don't add people no more. I don't do that. If I got, right now I got a whole, I can screenshot a whole list of friend requests I got. I don't know them fucking people. I don't deal with them people. So why am I trying to add them people? I got enough around me. I've been success, successful because of the people I have around me, not successful because I keep adding people. That's too much of a distraction for what I'm trying to do. So that's today's message for y'all. I hope y'all get that. You know, if you got social media accounts, followers is about quality, not quantity. If you got 600 strong, it's better than having 3,000 people that's screwing with you all the damn time. 
I'm not worried about 3,000 people. I'm worried about the 600 that's going to push me forward. The 600 that's going to be like, dude, you should be doing this, dude. And always be critical of each other. As we advance, we're critical of each other. That's what we're trying to do. I'm not trying to have somebody just criticize me behind my back talking, man, 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 just to see me fail. I'm not trying to do that. And when people like that around me, get rid of them. You don't need that in your life. You're too busy going forward to be worried about what's behind your back. Don't worry about them people. I got to get over here to this little business opportunity. Hopefully, I'll have some, some video for y'all on that because... It's going to be pretty lucrative, trust me. I'll be doing some critical thinking all the time. If this works, I'm going to try to promote this so other people can do it too.